Hi and welcome to another episode. Today I'm taking some photographs of uh, some sneakers. I just want to take you through my creative process, show you some ideas, maybe you're interested, you want to take some pictures of your new sneakers, post them on Instagram, or you have an upcoming gig and you need some ideas. This is the right video for you. Stick around. These are the pictures that I took. Okay, so let's get on with it. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the first photograph. It's me in the middle and a lot of flying uh, sneakers around me. I have the camera placed there in front of me, a bit lower down on the ground, have my lights. And the first thing I'm gonna do is take a picture of the background without me, just as a clean slate. And secondly, I'm going to um, place this where I'm going to stand and photo focus on this. I'm going to use manual focus, focus on this and then I'll take it away, take a picture of myself and then um, basically I will still shoot in manual and uh, place the sneakers around in the air either with my hand or I have here a pole with a wire and I have uh, one of my sneakers hanging on it and then basically I will either put the timer on or I have a uh, remote control and I'll just snap a photo like this of the sneaker uh, floating in the, uh, in the air. I'm going to be shooting at around 2.8 and I'll have a shallow depth of field and I'll be able to get the sneakers, if I have them in front or in the back, out of focus. So let's start. I'll try some others because I'm definitely not looking cool. So now I have my clean slate, I have a picture of myself. I have the camera still on manual focus and now I'm just going to start taking some of my sneakers and hanging them on the pole with the wire and taking some more pictures around myself and yeah, let's see how it looks. So I just have all the pictures that I need and I only have to stack all the pictures in Photoshop and mask all the stuff that I don't need out and this is the final result. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is just put them on my feet and wear them. After all, they were designed to do so and I'm going to take some pictures. Normally when I take pictures of products, if the light allows it, I will shoot at uh, higher f-stops so that the whole product is in focus. At the moment I'm shooting at around f6, what is it, f6.3 and basically for what I'm doing at the moment, the whole um, sneaker is in focus or basically the, the part that I want to I wanna sh showcase is in focus. Okay, enough sneakers worn. Now to the next set of pictures. Okay, so for the next picture, I'm just gonna place um, a sneaker on top of a mirror. I think this always gives us some cool reflections and what I'm also gonna do is use my TV as a backdrop and use this background that I found on the, uh, online 
to basically get some cool reflections. I also think it complements quite well the, the sneaker, so I'm gonna try to take some shots like this. So for the next picture, I'm just gonna use my TV again, because I don't have a cool background around here at home. And I'm just gonna hold out the, the sneaker. I'm gonna use also a shallow depth of field so that this uh, stadium is not that uh, in focus, just the, the, the sneaker. So let's get into it. Okay, for the next shot, what I'm gonna do is try and get um, the sneaker hover over my hand like this. And just by throwing it in the air, I have a remote here and I can just uh, throw it and, and take a, a shot with a remote. Quite important, I want to get a shallow depth of field so that I'm out of focus and the sneakers in, in focus. And when I'm throwing it in the air, I need to shoot very fast. So I'm shooting it at, what is it, 200 at least. Um, so one over 200 and then I have a high ISO. I'm at 1000 and an f-stop of 2.8. And I have my light here. So I think I'm good to go. I'm gonna try a few times. And if it doesn't work, I might hang um, the trainer or the, the sneaker from from a uh, from a string and just try and uh, place it over my hand and take some some pictures like that right let's see if i can get some pictures like this Okay, I think that was it. I'm gonna have a look. It worked out, so awesome. This is the result. Okay, so another easy but effective setup is just placing uh, the product, or in this case, the sneakers, onto a, a sheet of of paper in this case is a golden one you can get these very cheap at uh, a home depot store and um, yeah basically i have a gold one and as you can see i'm i've only got it on a um, small um, table but when i take the picture i'm only going to see the the gold and the shoe and i think it's going to look really good let's have a look I'm gonna try as well and see if I can get this in the landscape position. Whew. So it got late pretty quickly, it's 2, 2 a.m. I need to tidy up all this mess that I, I, I did in my living room. And yeah, uh, I hope you liked the video. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, bye.